Hey guys, Ducky here. Just thought I'd get a quick 252 Defender replay out. Yes, I did splurge and pick one up. Uh, first impressions are the guns. The gun is good and bad. Um, hits well, accuracy's a little bit terrible. Anything at medium range or further away, you won't be able to um, you know, snipe where you spot spots, that sort of thing. But um, shooting at anything that's the same tier or lower, you know, as long as you can hit it, you're, you're pretty much going to go through it. So, um, this is a game on Paris, which I will say is a map that I don't like at all. So I didn't think this was going to turn into much of a game, but we did have a little bit of fun. So, tier 10 match on Paris in a tier 8 premium tank. What could go wrong? So. We're off to a good start. We spotted a tier 8 medium down the other end. Decides to come back for us, which is rather nice. So a nice quick shot. 464 damage with this gun. It's got a 440 base, 225 pen, and 265 on the premium shells. Um, does have a big reload. Um, I've got a rammer, brothers in arms, and vents on this and I can get the reload down to about 12.3 seconds. Very lazy shot there but then again that's the accuracy of this one. I probably should have been aiming a little bit higher but with this gun it could go anywhere. So we've got 3.2 stock aim time, we've got vertical stabs and a, a four skill crew. So I th this one I get it down to about 2.2 2.8, something around there. So we're just hanging out with this IS-3 and really waiting for this T-57 to, to um, do some damage for us. And we're trying to get in behind the pack of enemy heavies down on, on the K-line that are engaging our heavies. I figure if I can turn their flank then that should make things easy for our guys. But uh, we'll see, we'll see, what, see what unfolds. I've still got a Panther 2 over on the far side. Type 61 looks like he's coming out, so we get in a position. So we've been spotted, but I don't think the Type 62 really has seen us until now. Just get that shot in. Which is nice. Shooting up tier 9 tanks. Looking again, but he's pulled right back. Somebody shot him, so we'll take the damage. And the Type 61 is down. So what else do we need to know about this tank? It's got a hell of a lot of armor. Uh, six degrees of gun depression, which is rather nice for a Russian heavy. And here we've run into a bit of a pack. So I've got a Type 61. Probably lucky to make that shot. Think about pulling back, but then I kind of decide to go for it and let the armor start to work because I only see a couple of lights and maybe a low so I figure I can take it because I'm not going to get outflanked because the field's sort of engaging those guys but I may be wrong making those assumptions so we got a lightweight, we just knock the tracks looks like he repairs and gets straight back out there Type uh, T71's never going to pen me so I don't really need to prioritize him E75 would be nice. Not a good shot, and I angled terribly there where the line weight is able to pin me. So, waiting for them to come to me. Low makes a terrible move there with the amount of side he's given me. Keeping my front to these guys where my arm is the strongest. Panther 2's joined in the fight as well, so it's me against four. Another shot into the low. He's not making it terribly hard. Waggle that way, waggle the other way. Somebody knocked down the tank 57. This is fine. Lightweight's out. Panther manages to pin me. Let's see if we can knock this guy. Looking for a shot. He backs off. What's the, 
the low is still making it relatively easy for me. And down he goes as well. So we've myself type 50, well, not even the type 57 against four. I took out two of them. One ran away and one got picked up by a TD. So not a bad little fight. We blocked two and a half thousand damage and done about the same in our own damage. This is where things get a bit dicey. Mouse comes in. Terrible shot at the mouse. Thought it might, but it's not so good. So whatever they've done to uh, buff the mouse is working rather well. We try to get another second shot into him, but... Same problem. And you would think that we're winning now, but now I've just been outflanked by the grill. And the enemy team is starting to claw back their tanks. So there you have it guys, that is the 252 Defender. Not a, um, not a bad tank. Um, obviously it makes uh, good money with such a high alpha and the survivability of the tank is quite high. So um, you should do well. I've, um, it's probably just as good at making credits as a Scorpion G. So um, yeah, let me know what you think. Thanks.